Okay guys, so welcome to my first classroom. I am so excited to set this up. I was originally going to teach third grade, but they moved me down to second, which is okay. Um, but I'll be teaching second grade math, science, and social studies. And so, yeah, I'm gonna turn the camera around so you guys can see what I'm working with. And we can go from there. So there is still a lot, like they have to remove one of those desks. Um, they have to remove some of these and then yeah. so yeah as you can see i am sweating but i brought up all of my stuff i am going to <sighs> they didn't like put the desk together for me or anything so i'm gonna go ahead and do that i don't even know if they've cleaned this room honestly i know that they still have a lot of work to do but that's what i'm gonna be doing for right now so i'll check in with you guys later okay so update on the classroom i they took out all of the furniture that they needed to take out and i have i'm pretty sure i'm like 80 percent sure this is how it's gonna stay so i'll turn you guys over and show you but yeah let's see so if i'm at the door of my room the first thing over here is like the storage closet the ipads there i have my um small group table I have my teacher table back there with my filing cabinet. I have, um, I need to fix the sizing of the desks, but I have six groups of four. So three tables here, three tables here. And then I have um, this cart, which I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with, and this board along with this table. So that is what we have so far. And now I am going to, sorry, I'm like totally out of frame. And now what I'm gonna do is start decorating, at least getting the bulletin boards up. I'm gonna organize like everything here, put certain things on certain tables. So like the bulletin board stuff will go on one um, group. My storage stuff will go on another group. My filing stuff will probably go all, all on my desk and go from there. And I will come back <laughs> when I've completed that okay so day one of classroom setup is complete i feel like we got a lot done even though if you were to look at my classroom you'd have no idea but um yeah and this cabinet here is actually broken which is like not fun but um yeah they're gonna have to fix that or i'm gonna have to do like a get like a makeshift way of fixing that but let me go ahead and turn you guys around and show you what we got done. Okay, so when you walk into my classroom, this is what you see. This is the door behind me, but I have something with the school name there, so I can't show you. I made my first bulletin board. I'm gonna do like a makeshift bulletin board on that side, and then another one on this wall. But here we have our storage cabinet, the iPad caddy. I'm gonna do like a student station there with like pencils um, and supplies for the kids. My small group table. I have six groups of four. And then my extra uh, desk is over here in the corner. Um, I have this over here, over there in that corner. I'm actually gonna put a, I think this is gonna be like a calming station or just like, you know, a calming corner. And over here is my teacher corner. So I've got my teacher desk with my name, my filing cabinet, my calendar, and all of that. So yeah, that is what we are looking like for day one um, compared to what the classroom looked like before. It is um, a lot of progress, but they still have to set up like my computer and there's just a couple things I have to ask them about in the office. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and yeah, I will see you guys in part two. Okay, so I am in my classroom again for day two and today's goal so yesterday i feel like i got a lot done when it came to like moving things but i'm still not like 100 percent sure that this is how i want it to stay exactly so i'm gonna go through see if i move <clears throat> anything else and then i also noticed that yesterday i didn't really film anything of like me setting things up so i'm also gonna go ahead and do that today as well so yeah we'll see We'll see what we get done today because I'm only trying to be here for about two hours. It's like 10 a.m. now. I'm trying to leave by 12. So, um, yeah. Let's see.
Okay, so we've made progress and I feel like I like it a lot better with how I moved everything around, especially now that I have like the chairs and everything. I feel like it's a good layout, but I'm still having trouble figuring out where to put my affirmation station because that is like the one thing that I just can't, I don't know, maybe I'll put it by my desk. Maybe I will, I don't know. Right now I just put it like next to my little file cabinet thing i'm pretty sure we're gonna get rid of these they told me yesterday in the office that um they already gave me my laptop but i think they said we're just gonna use our laptops for like everything so they might get rid of those desktops um i think i'll probably still have the printer obviously in case i need to print something i'm not sure so we'll see i'm not touching that for right now but let me go ahead and turn you around okay so right now this is what it looks like when you walk in to the left you have like my filing cabinet or my organization cabinet their ipad caddies i have the small area or the small group over there and then over here i have my desk my teacher desk will be back there I moved the student station over there because I'm gonna have like their turn-in bin and everything there. So I moved the caddy there so that, you know, in case they need to get supplies, they're towards the back of the room so they're not disrupting anybody. And it's kind of with the rest of where the, their things go. Um, for here, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna use it like at least this top one as a storage for their lunch boxes. So I'm gonna make a sign there that says lunch boxes so they can put their lunch boxes. And then here, I'm gonna label them groups one through six and then I will probably have them put anything that they might need to put or things that, you know, both classes will use um, so that they can have a mutual place to find them. And then I have my bulletin board right here. I'm still gonna do the makeshift bulletin board on the other side and the makeshift bulletin board over here. But for right now, I think I'm gonna go ahead and set up that 10 tier caddy. Okay, so I am heading out for the day. I got here at like almost 10.30 and now it is almost 12.30. It's almost 12.25 and I'm gonna stick to my word. I'm not gonna be here all day because trust me, I could, but I'm not gonna do that. So let me go ahead and show you guys what we got done and how the classroom looks after day two. Okay, so when you walk into my classroom, this is the first thing you see. I finished the makeshift bulletin board. I adjusted the student station. I put it over there. Um, I fixed this up a little bit and then over here I have my tables, my teacher desk back there with my file cabinet, my 10 cart, um, 10 drawer cart, uh, my whiteboard, and then my small group center, which I'm probably going to use as like a second teacher desk. And then over here I have my iPad caddy and my storage, which they have to fix because the store is broken. And then I am going to make another makeshift bulletin board there and possibly one right there i'm not exactly sure so we'll see that's this one is pending but for sure i'm gonna do one there just like the one i did over here so this is an overview of what the classroom looks like after day two there's obviously still a lot of things that i have to do so i have to um finish the bulletin boards i have to put everything up on the walls obviously 
I am crazy, but I am going to fix all of these desks because they are driving me crazy. So there are some like groups that look fine, but then there are some groups that the tables are still all wonky. So I want to fix those messed up tables so that they can all be leveled and not drive me crazy. Um, and then I'm not sure. So since they're possibly taking these computers out, I might lose that long table that I have in the back. But if I do, that's okay because I have like a six drawer cubby thing that I didn't bring in, but I can if I need to, to get that extra um, space for like the student center where they turn in their work and all that. So yeah, that is it for day two. I'm not sure if I will post this video as is like part one and two together or um, add day three in here. But yeah, I will possibly be back tomorrow, if not Friday for day three.